let's take you outside to the clouds that we're seeing over so much of the county. Chula Vista, La Jolla, downtown, but Poway, it is clear, as I mentioned at the uh, top of the hour, those clouds are already thickening up along our coastline to about maybe 10 miles inland, but Poway, you're right on the cusp. Those clouds are going to be coming, though, so a lot of us were stuck in the clouds, or at least saw those clouds much of the day. Maybe breaks in the clouds, just a little bit of sunshine, and cool temperatures today. A few areas were a little bit warmer. We really didn't see a big change in our temperatures. Low 90s in the deserts right now, 70s and 60s from the coast all the way out towards the mountains. Julian back in the 70s today. Tomorrow is going to be a little bit cooler. Not a big drop in temperatures, but maybe one to two, three degrees cooler. We're looking at 60s and 70s up and down our coastline, low to mid 70s for the inland neighborhoods, mostly mid 60s in the mountains, and low 90s are right around 90 in the deserts. I do think Borrego Springs is going to top off probably right around 89 degrees. 76 in Ramona and in Santee, Lemon Grove at 69 tomorrow. This is the next storm system, and we're actually going to be talking about this one for several days. It is very slow moving, so it is enhancing our marine layer right now. It is going to basically move over Southern California and stall through maybe all the way through Saturday. So latest forecast models have really slowed this system down on when it's actually going to be leaving us. I'm actually going to show you that in our next half hour, but I wanted to focus this time on the rain. So that chance for rain, this is 730 in the morning, many of coast inland and even maybe Julian waking up with those clouds, a few sprinkles, a little light drizzle is going to be possible. The best chance is going to be in the morning and then in the evening as we head into Thursday night. But I can't rule out a few sprinkles even during the day tomorrow. I would say it's not enough to cancel any of your plans. Maybe bring an umbrella, but the rain is going to be very hit or miss. So and it's going to be very light and it shouldn't last for very long. So if you have outdoor plans tomorrow or even Friday, because I now have a slight chance for showers into Friday, even into Friday night. At one point, it was looking like it would be possible Friday morning, but because the system is stalling, even Saturday morning, we're waking up with those overcast skies. So it's a system that's going to be with us through Saturday morning now. Through Friday, it's going to be cool with that chance for a little light rain. Temperatures this weekend will be about 5 to 20 degrees warmer. The warmest day is actually going to be Monday, and we're going to keep things warm into early next week, but temperatures will start to taper off slightly. Sunday, no longer looking quite as warm as it was looking earlier earlier this week because that system has slowed down. So mostly 80s instead of 90s Sunday for the inland neighborhoods, but we're mostly going to see 90s on Monday and Ramona will be in the mid 90s by then, but 70s through Friday. Mountains in the 60s through Friday, 70s on Saturday and then mid 80s Sunday and Monday. Monday, of course, the warmest day and a bit breezy in the mountain and desert areas. The next couple of days could see a few gusts reach up to about 30, maybe 35 miles per hour.